A lot of brands will launch with the idea that they're going to just get it to market and then figure it out as they go along. But rushing to market without a clear strategy will hold back your show or your podcast or your video channel. It's almost always better to slow down at first and avoid the common mistakes that new brands make. Here's some of those common mistakes that starts with coming on too strong. Everybody wants to make a big impact right away. You've got a million ideas and you're ready to start dominating, right? Now you got to slow down. The process of becoming a beloved personality means that you first have to be known and then liked. It's a journey that I call the personality success path, a five-step climb that starts with the introduction and then goes through familiarity, growth, like, and finally love. You've got to take them one step at a time. You can't leapfrog from introduction to love. It's like trying to run before you learn to crawl. So begin with your character brand profile, something that outlines who you are and how you blend into the lives of your target audience. Take it one step at a time. Second mistake is not embracing the audience's world. Winning the audience's heart is like winning over a friend. You discover their passions and you show them that you share the same interests. Once the audience feels like you get them, that you really understand them, they start forming a bond with you. Now you can kickstart the process by respecting and focusing on their experiences and designing your topic angles around those interests. Don't presume that the audience finds your content indispensable. I mean, how many times do you switch radio stations or turn off a podcast during a typical 30-minute commute to work? Those moments of tune-in might be the only opportunity that you have to leave an impression. Third mistake is not being prepared, and I mean strategically prepared. This isn't just about gathering the right content. It's everything to prep the ability to attract and dominate a fan base. So before you ever flip the microphone on, do this. Start with a character brand profile. This is a crucial first step to creating a defined character voice that the audience can understand. You can't reach the peak until you find it, and you have to have a compelling reason to exist. If you want details on how to do that, check out my five-star character brand profile course. It's at character brandcourse.com. Second is to know your target. You have to understand the audience and you have to know their interests, their values, their lifestyle, and it'll give you an idea of what they'll respond to and what they won't. And third is a brand vision. Establish what you stand for and what you stand against. It'll help you find your purpose. Speaking of purpose, a brand vision is your reason to exist. Uh, everyone wants to lead a large, loyal fan base, but that doesn't happen until you get attention. Your audience is first going to respond to what you do before they fall head over heels for who you are. But they're never going to get to know you without a compelling reason to exist. So what's your reason to exist? What's your brand vision? Start with a fusion force feature. It's kind of the way that James Corden rose to fame with Carpool Karaoke. What will cause the audience to care about you? So let's evaluate your brand. That's the next step. Evaluate your brand, evaluate your position. Are you connecting with the audience? Does your voice come through? Is it loud? Is it clear? Do you have a strong understanding of your character's voice? Plan for the future. Create a plan that will improve your brand. Remember to prepare a vision for the brand, uh, identify your audience's interests, and define your strong points. And identify that feature. What's your carpool karaoke? Find a unique, exciting feature that will make you stand out and cause the audience to remember you. Are you making some of those mistakes? These are common mistakes that new shows, personalities, programmers, podcasters, streaming video creators all make. If you're making some of those mistakes, don't worry about it. It's not unusual and it's not too late to fix those problems. Accelerate your growth and improve your results by starting with a character brand profile. You can get all the details at characterbrandcourse.com.